I just hit a major milestone of my longest living project and I would like to tell you more about it. This is the smart card platform. I like to pitch it as a versatile and easy to use vehicle platform for your hobby grade projects. On a hardware level, it is composed of a circuit board with many sockets, a gyroscope and a motor controller. It can be easily fitted on top of many Arduino microcontroller boards. Software-wise, it is made of an easy to use and very object-oriented library written in C++11, which abstracts all the different combinations of motors that might be found in miniature vehicles as well as hobby-grade sensors. The idea is for anyone to be able to control a vehicle and retrieve data from its sensors with minimum knowledge of hardware, electronics or even programming. To my knowledge, it's the most widely used piece of software that I have developed since for the last three years it's being used by the software engineering students at the University of Gothenburg for their systems development course. During the past months, I have been refactoring this library and now I'm proud to say that the following has been achieved. The third hardware revision has been released. The software library is not only 100% independent of the third hardware, but can practically be used with any motor combination. Additionally, it is more object-oriented than ever, so now sequential coupling is eliminated and the library is finally testable. Speaking of tests, we've got 100% coverage where the tests as well as the various code examples are being built on CI. And last but not least, all documentation is being automatically generated and published as a website upon every commit. Implementing and adopting all these software engineering best practices was very rewarding and, I should admit, relatively easy. So if I can do it on a hobby open source project, so can you, especially at your workplace or even studies. As always, everything about the project is open sourced, from the code to the board and the continuous integration setup. So please go and check it out on GitHub and let me know what you think. Thanks!